I'm going to show you how this thing works. So this is using Gmail, and this is how I would send stuff out. So basically, on the template side, when you click templates down here, what happens is a little window pops up. And you have different categories and you have different templates in there. So in this case, what I've got is in prospecting, I've got 18 templates that I can use live chat. I got six address service. I got four, so on and so forth. You guys can read and understand that sort of stuff. If I want, if you do it on the bottom, if I create a template, I can create a new one that I can add into my templates as well. So now when I click on that, what happens is uh, in this case, I've clicked on the prospecting and I found one where it's an ad that's on Kijiji. And for anyone from the U.S. or around the world that's uh, that's uh, coming in here, uh, Kijiji is eBay's ads up in Canada. It's a classified ad service, right? So in this case, you know, I used to go through and look at people that were advertising at Kijiji, and I'd try to reach out to them and see if I could connect with them to talk to them about a live chat service that I have. And so what happens is I've clicked on that. It says, here's the template. Then what I can do is if you look down at the bottom, I've got insert template or modify. If I click modify, if I, I can change some of the verbiage in there if I feel like at that point in time. Or when I just click insert template, boom, it goes right into that email. And I can change that then if I really wanted to as well, change any of the verbiage in there. So that's how you use a template. So, you know, instead of, um, you know, that would take you all about 10 seconds to do as opposed to typing this, which might take you a minute or two minutes to go through, create the hyperlinks, do all the stuff and everything like that. Now, here's another thing that you can do. As I say, I tie every single one of my emails back into my um, CRM system. And so what I've got, if you look down here, it's, it might be a little small for you guys to see, but there's a little button you click that's called CRM. And in Sightly, I've got a, uh, you can go in and set up what they call a blind CC that puts things into, um, puts it into the system. And um, so if you, once again, if anyone needs help on this sort of stuff, reach out to me. I can, I'd be more than happy to try to try to help you out, point you in the right direction on this stuff. But in this case, um, you know, it's already, it's blind CCing. So you see at the top BCC, uh, it's going to put that record into my CRM system. Now down at the bottom here, I've clicked track and what tracking does, it tracks is did someone click uh, open my message and if I have a hyperlink in there, have they clicked on that link and it's going to inform me and I'll show you guys a couple of things in a couple of minutes on that sort of stuff. Um, next thing is when I send this email out, you know, I can set it so that if, you know, if someone doesn't reply to this thing, I can follow up with them at a certain time frame. So a day, a week, a month, whatever it is, right? Or I can set it up so that, you know, no matter what, it just reminds me. So um, the system will send you an email and says, hey, you know what, here's the letter or the initial email you sent out, time to follow up with this person. Now, this is pretty cool. This is Gmail, as I talked about before with the, uh, the Outlook stuff, is I can attach a file and I can track when that file gets open. So it's not just a hyperlink on, a, on, a, on my email. When I add, actually attach the file, it's going to tell me when that file gets open. So I can tell when a client opens this. And if I send them a proposal or some information, I can also tell when they've actually clicked or opened up the document that I've attached, which allows you to follow up with them, obviously, because then you'll have that information in hand. And last but not least, let's say I create an email, but it's like Friday afternoon and I know no one's going to read it. And I want them to look at it on Monday. I could set it up for Monday at 8 a.m., 9 a.m., whatever time it is, and send it out to, uh, to them at that point in time. So this thing is amazing, and it will um, literally save you a ton of time and also give you way more insight and visibility into what your clients are doing. So here's where the power comes in. So this is something that's built into my Gmail and what it does is literally it just says, you know what, this person opened this email. So anything where you see a little green envelope on this, that tells me that people have opened the uh, open email. That blue linky looking thing at the very bottom there says that they've clicked on the link. And then I think actually if you put a report in, there's going to be, a, there'll be a little picture of a report that says it's open. The other thing you can take a look at is if you sent stuff out, down the left hand side, you can see, you know, who's, who's not opened my emails or who's opened it but not replied. And then I can set up like, you know, can I track this stuff? Should I follow up with these people? You know, who's clicked on stuff, so on and so forth. So great little system to get insight into your individuals or what people are doing. So there you are. There's who's opened my email. There's who's clicked my link.